What's up my Beastfires? Beastfire One here. Welcome back to what should be the last episode of Night in the Woods. Um, we just witnessed some terrible stuff. Ep epilogue star. So this is the epilogue. Um, we witnessed some terrible things, but we uh, we it, they are they're all in the past now, and we're in Maze waking up, and she's all fine now, fine and dandy. I wonder what our parents are gonna say this time. Gosh, it's us. It's just us, home and us. I don't know what this feeling is, but I'm not gonna cry today. Uh, the clock. Hey, granddad's clock. Hey, granddad. Aw, granddad. Bird! We're gonna eat you for Thanksgiving, bird. <laughs> can we go? What well, the question is, can we go in the safe? Can we go in the crawl space? We, uh, can we, we, of course we can go in the crawl space, but can we open the safe? We're about to find out. Nope. <laughs> that, that, mystery debunked. <laughs> Put it on screen. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. That's more. That's more editing for me. And I don't. I don't really like that. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> oh, wow, 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 wow. Why is this? Why? Why am I hitting my head on the on the uh, on the ceiling? I'm not. I don't mean to. It's like someone's controlling me. May, honey, is that you? Yeah. I'm back in the kitchen. If you want to talk. Yeah, of course, mom. I love to talk. Mom, 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 I have so, so much stories to tell you. Hey, sweetie. Hey, mom. How are you feeling? Good enough to jump up here. Can you do me a favor and stay home tonight? Uh... Why? It's been... I just... Like, you're an adult. And you can do whatever you want, but you do live here. And you are still my baby. Aw, oh, mom. We need to come up with some ground rules, just because. Honey, you could have died the other night. And then you just left it, left to hang out with your friends? I... I... I'm so sorry, Mom. Sweetie, what's going on with you? Uh, I've had a really tough year, Mom. Hun, you've had a tough week. We all have. Yeah, but... What happened at school, hon? I don't care what it is, just please, tell me. Are you working today? No, me and your father are both off today. I'll be around tonight, we can talk about it then. Sure. We can make breakfast for dinner like we used to. Can that dad, dad can flip the pancakes in the air? <laughs> sure. Are you going out today? Yeah. Can you please stay in town? Close. Yeah, mom. I think they're getting some of the longest night decorations out. Oh wow. Calling for some snow too. That went fast. What did? The fall. Always does, hun. Okay. Well, I'm off. I love you, sweetie. I love you too, mom. Such a bad. Su it's such, there's such a difference between love you and then I love you. So great. Are you still reading the same book? Oh no, this is a different one. This one's about people who died in the mines around here. Oh, cool. Not that I know anything about that. <laughs> yeah, it's very interesting. It's got some old songs. Wanna hear one? Sure. Far, far from here, the ocean's roaring, far away across the den. I hear the Lord call their children, bring it in, bring it in. I'll see you walking through the barley, we'll find each other, friend and kin. I hear the Lord call their children, bring them in, bring them in. Tarry me, tarry with me for a moment, talk the places we have been. The Lord will call us both to heaven, bring them in, bring them in. Was that good? <laughs> Was that a good rendition? That's nice. It is, it is nice. Any more songs, Mom? I want to I hear another one. <laughs> that's all? That's all you gotta say? Alright. Well, I'll see you later, Mom. Bless this mess. Bless this mess indeed. Bless it all. Bless you. Bless me. Alright. <laughs> let's, uh, let's go see. Let's go explore town a little bit. Oh, Dad's out here. Oh, I didn't even see him. Hey, Dad. Hey, Dad. No work today? I told Bob to shove it. Really? No. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Not, not gonna sugarcoat it, I hate my job. Aw, oh, Dad, why? I've mined, I've made glass, I've done a heap of other stuff, but this place, they just don't respect you for working. They don't? Job's supposed to pay you enough to live. Job's supposed to let you provide you, you provide for your family. Job's supposed to have regular hours. Boss supposed to respect you. Worker's supposed to be able to talk to you. Worker's supposed to be able to have a life. Worker's supposed to be able to live. Your mom always had to work, but I wanted to give you and her your time. I wanted her to have her hobbies and have enough time and money to do them. That's what made me happy. Now I just work so I can keep our health insurance and hold on to the house. Try to at least. Is there anything you can do? 
I mean, we do need a, need a union. It's just easier to say say it than get it done. Unions were always there uh, in the mines and the factory, at least for a while. But here, listen, I'm gonna be around tonight for dinner. Wow, that's what's the occasion? Well, mom said we can make breakfast. Ooh, sounds good. I was gonna talk about some stuff. Okay, maybe we could talk about your stuff too. Just one big uh, stuff session. That sounds great, kitten. I love you, dad. Love you too. Be back later. What are you doing out here, by the way? Getting an early start on our longest night lights plan. Gotta dig them out of the out of the closet. See if they even work still. Can I help put them up? We'll see. You're a small fry, dad. Dum de dum 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 de dum 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 de dum 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 dum. Oh, it's snowing. Oh, this is nice. It's starting to snow. Oh yay! I like I like as much as I like fall. As, a, as much as I like summer for the, like, you know, the warm weather and stuff. I like winter, because it's so pretty. Welcome to Historic Possum Springs. Wonder if it'll ever be a booming town again. Those guys last night were, like, deluded. But it'd be really nice. If there was a god. I might ask. But I think they'd have to fight the other gods. That bled this, that bled this place near the death. I'm, like, proud of us all. For having good lives. In a crappy, stupid, good town. Here's to you, Possum Springs. Here's to survival. Could have said it better myself, May. Oh, look at these, look at these drawings. My goodness. That's, that's what we saw last night. That's really cool. And May, May in like, in like the, uh, the abyss there. The, the guy who, who lost his arm. Man. That was also surreal, honestly. Selmers! Hey, May. Sup, Selmers. You okay? After the whole, like, head injury thing? Yeah, I'm alright. Headache is all. I got some migraine meds if you need it. Nah, that's not a migraine. And those things make me have to pee. It's the caffeine. If you ever take pills that make you pee, it's the caffeine. I didn't know that. Used to work at the pharmacy. Oh, right. Well, if I ever have a headache, or need to pee, I'll come by. Anytime, neighbor. Aw, don't have any more new poems for me? Aw, uh, what, what do you have to say, huh? What's, what's your opinion on me? Snow coming. Gonna be bad this year. Oh, well, definitely is. Is Mr. Chasikov? Mr. Chasikov's up there. Yay! I want to see more stars, or at least just talk to him for the time being. Chasikov! Hey! Hey, me! Hey, Mr. Chasikov! Got any more dust stars we can look at? One more! Oh, one more! Oh, we got one. Oh, the filter! The filter! Alright, where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Come at, come at me! Come at me! Where is it? Where is it? I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it pulsing with it, pulsing within my bones. Oh, 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 oh! I found it. There we go. Found it. Let us consult the guide. Ooh, what's that? The fire maker. The fire maker? A wanderer in the cold and dark, making a fire and huddling up to it for light and warmth. Sounds festive. Sounds like survival. Hmm. The star makes me want to cry. Crying on my roof. Do you wish to talk about it? No, it's fine. Is it a happy cry or a sad cry? I don't know. I don't have great words for it. It is okay. Sometimes too many words. Yeah. Thank you for this. Thank you for joining me. I think we have discovered them all? Well, we didn't really discover them, right? I mean, someone else had already saw them and named them, wrote a whole bunch of stuff about them, and we just, like, found what they made for us. Is that not the discovery? Not really. Maybe not in the historical sense. We did not create the stars, or name them, but we had these aft autumn afternoons, and found them together. Isn't that something? Something, something, something. My granddad sent, said something like that once. Something about a story having really happened, because hearing it happen to you. That is nice. It's not, it's not bad. Oh, look at them all. Yay! Look at that. Are those the constellations we all stole for the longest night? That was really cool. Look at them all. Dust, dust Stargazer, that's the achievement we got. So what now? Super moon is coming. What is that? A giant moon! Ooh, that does sound super. You must come meet me when it happens. It will be late at night. There will be others on the roofs. You come, I will make the, the hot chocolate. What a time. That sounds great. I want to see a super moon. Plan on it. See you later, Mr. Chaskov. See you soon, star Stargazer. Alright, let's see. Uh, Erk, uh, Erk's, Erk's kind? 
Is that what that is? Yeah. Hell, birds. Pumpkin dead, dead guy. Look at all these. Look at all these. Legends. Angus is good. Greg rules. Hardfest. Duke Possum Springs. Smash. Greg rules. Man, I, I would. I feel like we would have gotten more if we hang out with like. Oh, mom. If we hang out with like Bea, more. I'll probably. I'll probably do that in a separate playthrough. Though this game was really, really long as it is. But I like it. It was really fun. It's really fun. Uh, let's go talk to some more people then. Hey, fishing guy. What's up? When winter come and water freeze, here the fish can be at ease. The tunnel is not flooded ruin, it's a home, a place for doing. Sure, that works. Please go away. Nope, I'm, I'm here for everybody, I'm here to stay. I'm here in Boston Springs till the day that I die, almost, again. <laughs> till, till the day I actually die. Teens? Teens. Teens. What's up, dudes? Hey, you guys. Yeah. Stay safe, alright? Wow, thanks, Mom. Are you our new mom? Apparently, life, man, it goes slowly. Nah, dude. Nah. Stay safe out there. Get you, you teens out there, stay safe out there. Don't, don't talk to strangers. Don't put dangerous things in your mouth. Don't do the drugs, honestly. I, that's the one thing I vowed, I vowed to do never in my life, not to do drugs. I mean, I, I've said like I won't drink, and and I'll be, I'll, be, I, I'm open with you guys. I, I do drink, but not, not a lot. Not to the point where um. Where I don't remember anything, and I don't, I, and I don't drink that often either. Um, like only at parties and stuff like that. But it's like when you when you think of, when you see people drunk like that, it is funny. But then like you gotta you have to worry about their well-being at some point or another, because it's just like, well, it's, it, you get worried a lot, right? And you want you want them to to feel feel better, feel well, and uh, stuff like that. All right, well, enough about me rambling. Let's go talk to mom. Mom. Hey, 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 hey. Oh. Oh yeah, she doesn't have <laughs> She doesn't have work today, that's right. He'll look a lot friendlier when he's covered in snow. I I assume he will, but then he'll burn it off with his laser or fire eyes or whatever it is. Hey. Hey. Well hey there, May. What are you doing? Oh, just cleaning up. How did the council vote go? We lost. I lost. It was just me pushing for it, really. We've got we've we've got all this. Empty space. Could use it for so many things, but he tried. All, all we can do, and God will show up when the time is right. Bruce was my friend. Mine too. Bruce was my friend too. You need some help cleaning this place up? That'd be nice, May. There's a rake back in the shed behind the church. Oh, I, I can't do it now, but haha. <laughs> Run along, May. Okay, I will. Is there anything over here? There's the, uh, there's the water tower. Anything I'm missing? Oh, snow. Oh, look at all, look at all those messages. Oh, let, me, let me read them. Uh, R2B, MS, MTST, sucks here. SC, LTD. A lot of stuff, a lot of writings there. Wonder if everybody, if, wonder if, uh, all, what if, if all the adults at, the, at some point came over there and wrote something on there? Oh, hi, janitor. Hey, it's you. Yep, yep. For now, at least. You know, I never got your name. I'm the janitor. I clean up, do fits, it's whatever needs done. Oh, okay. So what's it been like, being home again? Things like, you remember him? Uh, no. I don't know. I don't even remember today. Sounds like you've been through something. How'd you know? Call it experience. I swear some mornings I feel every bit as old as these trees. You know, something big did happen. And I feel like I should have woken up today. And like, I've learned something. But I don't know if I learned anything, really. Well, in my experience, the big things don't teach you anything. But they make you something. And sometimes you gotta wait a while and see what come what come of it. Huh. Well, done an honest day's work. Quitting time. Smelter's game tonight. See you around. Not if I see you first, May. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You creepy. Kinda creepy, though. I like you, though. Wait, how do you know my name? That's true, how did, how did he? Janitor, Mr. Janitor, Lord Janitor, Bob Janitor. Thought, I get, I get a job as a janitor and really enjoy it. Probably, if you put your mind and heart to it, as much as you can with scrubbing up footprint tracks and poop everywhere. Just, just poop, just poop everywhere, dude. 
Alright, let's see. Uh, video outpost. Angus is in here, eh? Let's go, let's go check in on, on my boy. On my, oh no, he's not here. Are you not in the back, Angus? Are you not looking at the adult videos? Freaking Angus, man. <laughs> Holy crap! Uh, ah! A taco place! This is the best thing that's happened to this town since they got rid of all those snakes in the diner. Uh, they got rid of all the snakes in the diner. The owners were religious, and they called in a preacher from one of the holiness camps up in the hills. And he got in there and he yelled at the snakes to leave. The next day after that, after he died, they just set traps. Nobody knows where they came from or why they moved in, but they're long gone now. Gosh, life moves on, huh? Taco book. Oh my gosh, they deliver. I'm gonna eat the crap out of some tacos. Yeah, all right. Oh, hey, it's a... Uh... So you're a taco dude now? I mean, it was hard to be a taco... Oh, it's the cat guy. I mean, it was hard to be a taco, taco artisan. But I guess that means holding the sign out in the snow. It's not really snowing that hard. It's snowing. There is snow in the sky, falling. How are the tacos in there? Good. I like tacos. There is not one person on Earth, on God's Earth, who doesn't love tacos. Bad news. My, my ex hates tacos. Good news. They're now your ex. <laughs> Have fun with your tacos. Eh, it pays. Can I talk to you some more? Taco buck. Dine in, dine out. We deliver. Please tip your delivery persons. Best tacos in all the general region. Pretty sure. Been missing the pizza place? Why not try pizza taco? Oh wow, that sounds amazing. Watching your health? Try out all lettuce taco. No, I refuse. Get out of here, kid. I'm working. Get out of here. Get, get, get out of here, boy. I can't go up there anymore. Oh, hey. What, where's the guy... Where's the other guy? Who are you? Haven't you seen me around? Nah. Well, I've noticed you. That's not weird or anything. But cold for stand, big cold for standing outside, eh? Someone's gotta stand out here. Hey, you Smelters fan? Uh. Uh, yeah. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Go Smelters. Go Smelters. Go Smelters. Yeah, oh yeah, that's it. That's the stuff right there. Okay, before I before I visit Greg. Anything over here? No, no place for me to find a, find a, find a fallen off arm or anything. Is Germ out here? Hopefully he is. I want to see Germ again. He wasn't there. <laughs> hey, Greg. Well, look who's alive and well. Is that a surprise? Nah, just seems like relevant. Well, look who's alive and well, you too. Yeah. Yeah. You want to get out of here? Do a band practice? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, man. Let's do it. I'm up for I'm up for a song I don't know. Are we, can we can we play a uh, uh, Die Anywhere Else again? Can we do that? I like that. What? Um. Jeez, that door never gets any less stuck. Worst when it's cold somehow. I'm so ready for cold weather. Ah, oh, I hate winter. Winter's actually good. Uh, nobody here yet. Bunch of slackers. It's like they don't even want this band to succeed. <laughs> Where would we even play if we wanted to? Hmm. I have no idea. Go play those VFW Hall shows in Fort Lucene. Oh wow, those are fun. We be the oldsters now. Yep. Where are you going? So, uh, you okay? Uh, not really. I mean, are any of us? I don't know. Angus slept, slept pretty soundly last night. Hmm, suspicious. Sit, sit with me. Yay. Do you think those guys can get out of the mine? I guess we're gonna find out pretty quick. Did you notice anyone missing today? I don't know. But I don't think a lot of those guys were people I knew. Can never tell. Can never tell? This kind of thing often happened to you often? Oh, all the time. So, like, I don't really get what even happened down there. With you. And the whatever that was. The murder cult of dads. <laughs> the cosmic horror. The murder cult of dads. I like that. Sure. I kind of get them. Really? No. Yes. I don't know. It's like a porch light that's on. And there are a lot of bu all these bugs around it. And then the light goes out. And there's a hole where the light was. It's like what happened to me back w way back. Like I was telling you about on the couch last night. Gosh, that was last night? Seems like two weeks ago. <laughs> yeah. No. Oh. It's going to be weird when you're gone. Well, I mean, you've already been gone. And you've been gone at least once since we, you got back. At least. I died a little getting the, that battery the other day. See? You're a goner. 
like last night. It feels sometimes like there's so much horrible past still trapped in this historical society from the other night. Just realize I know what that painting was. What was it? Never mind. But it feels like the past can't just leave. And it's still here. You're like swimming in it. And you can't have a future. Nah, brah. You can have a plenty of future. Nah, brah, that's it? What was our biggest crime ever? Almost bringing down the school, bringing a horrible robot son into the world. A horrible robot son into the world. And then leaving him to hunt the woods out by the highway. Actually, it was probably trapping those dudes in the mine and leaving them to die. That was self-defense. All that, all that stuff. Like, today's different now because of what happened. Because that happened. We're different. Yeah. So, like, things change. I guess. Like you said the other day in the woods. Gonna be different because we were here. That's something. Something, something, something. <laughs> My granddad said that. And they killed Casey. Yeah, they did. They killed, they killed Casey. I'm trying not to think about it. Do we, like, tell his parents? What do we tell them? I don't know. Is it worse to let them think he's alive? Or tell them he's in a bottomless hole? In a tunnel? In the woods? With a bunch of guys who are going to be dead soon? We should tell them, or... Um... I don't know. We should, we should tell them. Okay. You get to figure out what to say. I'll let you know if I ever come up with anything. Sounds good. I think it's important that we know at least. Makes it mean something. I don't know how to say it. I think we might be the only ones in the universe who care about anything. Or who even can care. Do you think any of us, any of this means anything? Or like, meant anything? Hmm. Does it, Gregory? Oh, the others are here. Hey. Hey. Hey, babies. Hey, hon. Babies? How was work? Jeez, I'm sore from, like, everything. Gotta do stretches. So, like, can I move to Bright Harbor with you guys? Uh, um, I thought you could, you, like, couldn't leave home. Eh, you guys are home enough. Or maybe I'll just visit you for a while once you get settled in. Of course. Yeah, dude, that'd be rad. Thanks. Hey, guys. Yeah? Thanks for saving me last night. Like, repeatedly. Not even a problem, dude. We'll save you as many times as it takes. Here comes Bea. Hey, Bea. Hey, Bea. Hi. What's up? Are you gonna say something? I don't really know what to say. When the hell even happened last night? Ah, don't ask me. Ah, nothing. Uh, nothing. Nothing at all. Oh, good. So I was just having the worst, weirdest nightmare ever. By the way, nice messages to wake up to. Oh, God, I was half asleep. Let's not talk about it. I think I twisted my ankle last night. Can we all just, like, not talk about last night for the rest of the day? Uh, no promises. Can we just play a song and get pizza and talk about this tomorrow? Sure. Whatever. We can all talk about it in therapy for years. That's the spirit. I mean, we have to go. We have to go on, right? Obviously, the world is seriously screwed up, screwed up, but we're all gonna die if we don't keep living. That's some bumper sticker crap right there. Hey, I know what I'm talking about. We gotta make plans. We gotta change things. We gotta play a gosh dang song and get a gosh dang pizza. Okay, so what are we playing? Uh, do I get to choose? Oh, that's it? Do I get do I, do I get to play? That's the end of the game! Oh, man. Oh, well done, well done. Alright, so... My thoughts on this game, really well, really well, really well written, and really well, you know, the music like went on with, uh, went with everything, it was very, uh, appropriate to what was happening. The plot I didn't, I kind of fell off track, it kind of fell off track a little bit, and there was so much exposition for, um, shh, shut up, bro. shut up, shut up, shut up, I'm trying, I'm trying to talk to the people, I'm trying to talk to the people. <laughs> um, the uh, the plot there, there's too much. Um, I feel like there's too much exposition for um, what for, um, for like in that like towards the end. Like it was just a little too much to take in. Then again, it might just be me like not understanding much of it. But um, yeah, I really like I really like the care. I like the dialogue. Like how much dialogue there was for each day. Like how um, like if you go if you go to the same spot, maybe it would say something different. Maybe she wouldn't. You could talk to some. You could talk to some people. You could talk to, to. You could talk to other people, and um, they would say something different every time. It was so good, 
And um, that's why that's what I really like about these kind of games. Uh, you you're immersed in the character's world, and like what May said, like you you could you could connect with the people um, on a, on a, on a on an emotional and mental level. And with May, like I think that like she she ha she's had she's had the roughest time. I think I maybe I think Angus the, has, but I think May is the one I could relate to personally. Um, you sometimes you don't really know where you want to be in this world. And, uh, I, I'll, I'll admit, I've, I, I kind of feel that, like, when I'm in school, like, why am I here? Like, why am I doing, am I why am I learning this? Why am I learning any of this? But the fact that, um, that I have people there that support me and care, and care for me, it kind of, it feels like a home to me. And Eco the cat. Eco, you are a great cat. Nine of the Woods, Unity, Pro, Fmod Studio, anything else after this? Sharkle! Yay, Sharkle! <laughs> Woo! Hi! Bye, Sharkle! Aw. R.I.P. Casey at the end of everything. Those are all our journal entries. And obviously, we could have gotten more if, um. If we got, um. If we, if we hung out with Bea more often than not. So, at, at the beginning, it was Rip Granddad. And all the way at the end, at the end here, Rip Casey. R.I.P. Casey, rest in peace. Eating some pizza. Oh man. Okay, that was okay. Once again, that was really, really good. Um, the art style was really was really good too. Um, I love how fluid the character animations were. I love how um, it, like these kinds of games like let me let loose on like voices and stuff like that. People have always told me that. When I, whenever I do impressions or stuff like that, I um I should go into voice acting and like I, I appreciate them for that, but um you know it's <laughs> maybe I could maybe I could do some like freelance stuff, but uh, yeah, I, like I, I always get jealous of other voice actors like Pro CD or <laughs> that's the one example I can come up with right now. Um, they also battle. He's a good voice actor, um, but yeah, um I want to thank you all so much for watching this series. Um, it, it has gained a lot of traction since it, since its start. And uh, I know I know I was late to the party on that on Nine in the Woods, but it, I, I I thoroughly enjoyed it through and through. And um, if you guys haven't played this for yourself, go play it right now because it's super good, super awesome. I'm not sure if I want to do a second Bea playthrough because there's Greg's ending and then there's Bea's ending where you have like different dialogue options, you have different hangout places. So yeah, if you guys want to uh, want to see that, let me know in the comments. And yeah, thank you IF, uh, IF uh, Studios, I think, for making this. You made one hell of a game. And thank you all so much for watching this series. If you've enjoyed it, like, comment, share with a friend, consider subscribing, hit the bell down there to become notified. And until then, fight to peace, my friends. Stay awesome. Have an awesome day. See you all next time. Bye.